Hey, what's going on guys? This is Kedar here. Today in this video on California's inflation relief check payments, as per the latest update that we got, according to the Franchise Tax Board California, their portal have been updated, their middle class tax refund page has got a new update. We have got couple of updates right onto the Franchise Tax Board portal and looks like we have got the new details on California's inflation relief payments. Most importantly, there is a bit of a change in the schedule for debit cards. When the debit card cards will be issued for the Californian residents. The key dates, the updated schedule of the payment and as for the latest details that we got from Franchise Tax Board, these debit card payments will be sent out according to whether you have received your Golden State Stimulus Check 1 or 2 and whether your last name begins with A to Z, particularly characters beginning with A to L and last name beginning with M to Z. And according to this criteria, Franchise Tax Board have provided the new dates updated dates for the California's inflation relief payments and also speaking of the direct deposit payments we have got updated dates for all the recipients we are getting this latest update from state of California franchise tax board itself also they have updated their portal with new estimated my payment amount where you can answer few questions and get your eligibility how much money you'll receive very quickly so today in this video on California's inflation relief payments you could say four stimulus check for Californians, all the latest details, the key dates, the updated schedule of the payment for debit cards, also for direct deposits, all the latest important information for Californian residents. So before we jump right into the video, we upload videos every single day. So make sure to check out other financial videos, latest stimulus update onto our channel and do subscribe with bell notification turn on that will keep you posted on latest videos like this and don't forget to hit that like button for me. So guys without further ado let's get right into the video and as for the latest details from state of california franchise tax board their middle class tax refund page has got a new update and speaking of the new details on how inflation relief dollars will be distributed to all the eligible taxpayers expecting the debit cards as for the latest update they are offering more specific details based on the last names and previous stimulus payments and the change updated on state's franchise tax board website on thursday evening now shows a timeline of when a middle class tax refund issue and state will be announced and if you have previously received golden state stimulus check regardless of the last name the issuance date will be announced after october 17th so without further ado let me show you what are the new updates onto the franchise tax board so franchise tax board is working with money network financial in order to get this debit cards up and running as soon as possible and speaking of the eligibility for middle class tax refund if you have filed your 2020 tax returns by october 15 2021 then you are eligible. Also, you need to meet certain adjusted gross income that is CAAGI limits described on the page. Also, you should not be claimed as a dependent on another taxpayer's 2020 tax returns. You need to be a California resident for six months or more of the 2020 tax year. And also, you need to be a California resident on the date payment is being issued. And speaking of how you'll receive your payment, Californians will receive their middle class tax refund payment either by direct deposit or via debit card. And particularly, Particularly, we have got the updates regarding middle class tax refund debit card payments when this payment will be mailed out to eligible taxpayers. But before that, let's check out who are eligible to receive the debit cards, MCTR debit cards. So you will receive your de payments via debit card in the mail if you have filed a paper tax returns. Also, you had a balance due and you have received your Golden State Stimulus payment by check. So it could be Golden State Stimulus 1 or Golden State Stimulus 2 or you have received your tax refund by check regardless of filing method and you have received your 2020 tax refund by direct deposit but you have since changed your banking institution or bank account number or probably you have received an advance payment from tax service provider or you have paid tax preparer fees using your tax refund. In all these cases mentioned over here, you will receive your payment through a MCTR debit card. And now coming to the most important information when you will receive your payment. So this middle class tax refund direct deposit payments for Californians who have received Golden State Stimulus 1 or Golden State Stimulus 2 are expected to issue. Well, these payments are expected to be issued to the bank accounts from October 7th, 2022 through October 25th, 2022. 
2022 and the remaining direct deposit will occur between October 28, 2022 and November 14, 2022. And speaking of the MCTR debit card payments, this middle class tax refund for Californians who have received Golden State Stimulus 1 or Golden State Stimulus 2 will they are expected to mailed between October 25, 2022 and December 10, 2022. And speaking of the remaining debit cards, those debit cards will be mailed by January 15. 2023 so speaking of the direct deposit payments if you have received golden state stimulus 1 or golden state stimulus 2 via direct deposit then you should expect your payment the mctr payment issued through october 7th 2022 going all the way up to october 25th 2022 if you didn't have received your previous golden state stimulus payment then you should expect your payment by october 28th 2022 going all the way up to november 14th 2022 And now coming over to the debit card payments, those recipients who have received Golden State Stimulus 1 or Golden State Stimulus 2 check and their last name beginning with A to Z, well, we have got the payment issue date for those recipients and these payment issue date will be announced after October 17th, 2022. So if your last name begins with A to Z and if you have got Golden State Stimulus 1 or Golden State Stimulus check 2 previously, then your payment issue date will be announced. after October 17th 2022 so make sure to watch these dates carefully speaking of the non golden state stimulus recipients and their last name beginning with a to l well those recipients for those recipients the payment issue date will be announced after november 7th 2022 so make sure if your last name begins with a to l then your payment issue date will be announced after november 7th 2022 and now coming over to the last group of people all the non golden state stimulus recipients whose last last name beginning with m to z well your payment issue date will be announced after november 21st 2022 so make sure to watch these dates very carefully for your payment issue dates so to recap this details for the golden state stimulus recipients your date will be announced after october 17th 2022 and non golden state stimulus recipient if your last name begins with a to l your payment issue date will be announced after november 7th 2022 and if your last last name begins with m to z and if you are non golden state stimulus recipient your date will be announced after november 21st 2022 and typically this direct deposits will occur within 3 to 5 business days from the issue date but may vary according to the financial institution so you may need to allow up to 2 weeks from the issue date in order to receive your debit card by mail and franchise tax board expect that about 90% of the direct deposit will be issued after october 2022 and about 95% of the middle class tax refund payments whether direct deposit or debit card will be issued by end of this year speaking of the eligibility criteria you can check your ca agis 2020 form and on line 70 you can check your adjusted gross income onto this lines given onto this particular forms and speaking of the married couples filing jointly if your adjusted gross income is $150,000 or less with a dependent you can get $1,050 and without dependent you can claim $700 if you earn $150,000 to $250,000 with a dependent you can get $750 and without dependent you can claim $500 those who earn between $250,000 to $500 thousand dollars with a dependent they can get six hundred dollars and without dependent you can claim four hundred while those earning five hundred thousand dollars or more are not qualified for these payments speaking of the heads of the households or qualifying widower if your ca agi reported on your 2020 tax return is one fifty thousand dollars or less then with a dependent you can get seven hundred dollars and without dependent you can get three fifty dollars and those earning between one fifty thousand dollars to two fifty thousand dollars with a dependent you can get $500 and without dependent you can claim $250 those earning between $250000 up to $500000 with a dependent you can get $400 and without dependent you can get $200 those earning between $500000 or more are not qualified for these payments in speaking of the single or married couples filing separately if you earn between $75000 or less with a dependent you can get $700 and without dependent you can get 
$250, those earning between $75,000 to $125,000, $500 with a dependent and get $250 without a dependent, while those earning between $125,000 to $50,000 can get $400 with dependent and without dependent they can get $200, while those earning between $250,000 or more are not qualified for this payment. And if you need any sort of help regarding your payments, whether you, your payment is got stuck, any particular issue regarding the payments, you can get a call onto this number. Also, if you are getting confused with your tax refund, how much money are you going to receive? You can simply head over to their payment estimation tool. So right here onto the middle class tax refund page, there is an option for estimate your payment amount right over here. So you can simply click over here. Then here onto this page, you will be asked a uh, simple questions like this. So first for the middle class tax refund eligibility, did you have filed a complete 2020 tax return by October 15th, 2021? Then you can answer yes. Also speaking of the dependent status for 2020 tax return, are you claimed as a dependent on anyone else's tax filing? You can answer no for the eligibility. Are you California residents in 2020? Well, definitely you can answer yes. Speaking of the filing status, you have got all those options right over here. So so you can answer any of them and here for married filing jointly I will select then you need to report your CA AGI as reported in your 2020 tax returns so let's say if it is $150,000 or less and speaking of the dependents do you got any dependents you can click yes and then it clearly shows you the estimated payment that is $1,050 by simply answering few questions like this and guys with that being said that sums up all the details on latest California inflation relief checks you could say four stimulus check for Californians soon they are on their way. I hope this video was quite helpful so make sure to hit that like button for me. Do check out other videos from our channel regarding latest stimulus update and all that. Make sure to subscribe with bell notification turn on that will keep you up to date on latest financial videos, stimulus update, statewide stimulus update like this. Thank you so much for watching this video till the end and this is Kedar from How to Guys signing out.